giving each other unwavering support, no matter what life throws at you. Some good and joyful, some bad, wrapped in a whole lot of unexpected. You both have proven how strong the relationship is. Facing it together, weathering the moments, growing together stronger, leaning on that foundation of your relationship. And this ceremony is another piece of that foundation. I met this girl oh, five years ago. I never thought I would find someone that could put up with my shit. But she did. She put up with it. It made me happy, you know. You know, you don't think it's real until it happens. I love you, Meg. I love you, babe. I love you. Growing up with this guy, you know, he's six years younger than me. And in that short six years, um, I learned that it, that six years was amazing. I admire the courage, support, love, and patience Travis has for my sister. I feel the two of them have climbed their last mountain. Their love story is fulfilled. take Megan to be your wife, to live together in the estate of matrimony. I will. Megan, will you take Travis to be your husband, to live together in the estate of matrimony, so long as you both shall live? Will you do this? I will. Megan, I make the following promises to you. Travis, I make the following promises to you. I will be faithful to you. Be honest with you. I will respect you. I will share my life with you through the good times, the hard times. No matter where life leads us. By virtue of the powers vested in me by the state of Illinois and our constitution, I pronounce you husband and wife. I present Mr. and Mrs. Johnstone. Travis and Megan are like yin and yang. Travis is my sister's bookworm, and Megan has shown Travis what strength is. The two of them have climbed many mountains, making them a strong, unstoppable couple. Cheers to Megan and Travis, love you both, and cheers to many years to love and happiness.